we maneuver on to our women's ski brand and black belt professional middleweight semi-final here between Isadora Silva and Damara Silva. Isadora with the red belt. Damara currently working off the back here looking for the De La Hiva in the white gi. Tamara, 27 years of age from Brazil. Isadora briefly looking for the foot lock there. Looked like she was trying to work the esteemer lock potentially. But Tamara with 27 years of age, 61 wins with the AJP Tour, 25 by points, 19 by submission, 9 by walkover, 5 by decision, and 3 by disqualification. So no stranger to the competition. Last tasted gold back in June 2021 at the AJP Tour South America Continental Pro. She won two of those fights by submission, one by disqualification and one by points. And Isadora, 26 years of age, black belt in the jiu-jitsu. 33 wins with the AJP Tour. Ooh, footwork attempt here now for Silva. Looking to get to the top position. That's again, an awareness of the game. Not chasing that submission. Looking to get to that top position to command and control. She's got an advantage point here. But that's a smart play here in the semi-finals. To secure the spot in the finals to fight for the goal. That's what it's all about, that top spot in the podium. And the game-changing prize money. We heard Andre Gaval talk about the fact that the, the tours allowed him to change his life in his own words, his ability to control where he trained, how much that he trained, and also to make it available to him to train as a professional. So an important aspect for these athletes, both male and female, coming through the ranks to be able to dedicate their time to the craft. And we all know that you need money to be able to train professionally. So the uh, prize money from the competition available to the athletes in winning their respective divisions allows them to continue that dream. Silva has nine submissions to her name with the AJP Tour, 20 by points. Last tasted gold at the Abu Dhabi Grand Slam Jiu-Jitsu World Tour in May 2023. She won gold, had two fights, won both by points. She also won gold at the Abu Dhabi Grand Slam Jiu-Jitsu World Tour in London in March 2023. Won all of her matchups by points. The two storied veterans here on the AJP Tour, experts in the game. At this point here, Zadora edging her way forward with one point advantage lead. Coming up to a minute and 30 seconds left in the semi-final. Wonski Brown and Black Belt Professionals at middleweight. This one under 70 kilograms. Scramble from the top position from Silva. Really trying to command that top position. I like the way she's driving that knee forward as well and consistently fighting the legs of her opponent. It's a key for her to stay in this top position. Mara trying to initiate a back take here off that De La Hiva. Might end up giving up the guard pass. If Isadora can force the hips forward here and command that top position. Looks like she's looking for uh, north-south here. It's going to switch through maybe to expose the back. Which for her to get the hooks in here. Advantage again for Isadora. It's nice work from Isadora here. Two-point lead. 40 seconds left on the clock. She's got one hook in here. Already looking to manipulate the gi. In the pursuit of setting up the choke. Ten seconds left here. Isadora doing a great job trying to secure her spot in the final. Looks like we have the time elapsed here. Tamara knowing that it was over. Isadora pushes forward to the finals. Another advantage for good measure at the end. 
Stay tuned for more action coming your way here on the AJP Tour. The installment in Miami here, the Watco Center, the action rolls on.